catch me live! This is my streaming schedule for the week this video comes out. If you miss this window, check out my Twitter or my Twitch page to see the latest version. Maybe I'm streaming right now. Hello. Ah, you Tressa? Yeah. Those sticking pirates can't forget them for this. I'm getting everybody's things back, no matter what it takes. Here we go. Her name is Tressa, and she is a merchant. A tiny port town in the coastlands is the only home she's ever known. Here in Rippletide, she cuts deals and stocks shelves, doing all she can to keep her family shop afloat. Nice puns. And now from the quays, she's walked a thousand times, unless they're keys, what do I know? She looks out upon the endless sea and dreams of a wider world. When she is robbed by a band of thieving pirates one day, her pride as a merchant won't allow her to back down. And so she vows to set off for the pirate's den. She will need daring allies on the path she has chosen. Sweet! Find comrades and add them to the party. Seek out them and they will help you. Complete chapter 1 of the story and they will join you on your journey. After chapter 1 you can change party members at the tavern. Take Tressa along. Travel to other areas may be restricted until you complete certain tasks. Cool. Hear the beginning of her tale? Sure. So we're going to just switch over now? Your, reptile, your reputation in Rippletide has improved. I guess so. Alright, into Tressa. We go. Again with my, my phrasing. It's not the best. This world is brimming with treasures. And I know that what I'm searching for is waiting for me out there somewhere. So I'll set sail for the horizon and the great big world that lies beyond. Gamer with two bits. You're off again. See you later. Enjoy streaming. I uh, hope your other streams get fixed soon. See you next stream. Thank you. Next one's on Saturday. A week. Six days away. Well, the shop ain't gonna stock itself. Oh, okay. Morning, Ma. Morning, Pa. Morning, Tressa. Looks like our number one employee is ready for another day of work. Sure am. And I'll start by stocking up the store. Hold your seahorses, little lady. Tell me, what are the three things a merchant needs most? They need to be smiley, mannerly, and early. Thought you had me, didn't you? <laughs> You're too clever for me, Tressa. Now off you go. Leave it to me, Pa. Be careful out there, Tressa. This is the life the dancer wants, but nope, her father was like murdered. It's a bit of a different story, Tammy. Ooh, those pirates have been causing trouble around the tavern lately. If you see them, you make sure to keep a wide berth, you hear? Got it, Ma. Be back in two ripples of the tide. There she goes. She reminds me of myself when I was that age. Always running off somewhere, wanting to prove myself a full-fledged merchant. Don't flatter yourself, dear. Our Tressa is something special. Sweet! Okay. First things first, let's gear ourselves out again, sure. Oh, no, not here. Um, I'll take this. Did I not take that last time? I guess not. Hello. Oh, I can't get around back there, can I? I'll take the, the dollars. Thank you very much. Hello, you? I probably can't bar to you, can I? Greetings to you. No. Just a crazy fruit guy. Okay. See you later, Blue Pikmin. Oh! 
Well, if it ain't the hardest working merchant in town. You ever beat some fishermen to the pier? Even. <laughs> Don't sound so surprised. We both know the early bird gets the worm, or in our case, the fish. You're darn right it does. Well, here's the catch of the morning. Blue marlin, I see. A big one, too, with a lot of meat on it. Bones. Don't know why she's going a little low-pitched voice, but oh well. I can, I can give, give you, you this, this much, much. for it. It's worth a little more than that. This one's a whopper. I guess I'll just have to take my business elsewhere then. Your hook snacked its innards. I was willing to overlook the damage, but... Fine. You got yourself a deal, Missy. Pleasure doing business with you. Not bad. You drive a hard bargain. You're a born natural at negotiating. I was wrong to underestimate you. Ye. <laughs> you got that right. I may not look like much, but I can haggle with the best of them. I learned my lesson. Well, don't be a stranger. Oh, well, yeah. thanks again. I gotta decide on that voice. All right. Next up, why? Okay, so what, I gotta barter it out of someone now? Just buy it, sure, okay. We have the finest mead. Always looking for a bargain. Another day, another deal. Deal so good, it was practically a steal. I never saw anything out of that guy who appeared this up in the cathedral. This up our little shop. Our little shop. Just me, Ma, and Pa. If I don't take over, I will. The ocean is so vast. I always wonder. I try to lie back and enjoy the cutscene, but nope. Suddenly it goes into not voice acting work. What do I really want to do? What do I really want in life? And then I wonder. What's for dinner? What oh. Lies beyond oh, what the lies beyond the horizon? Yeah. Drop anchor. We kind of got spoiled on this story, but oh well. I haven't seen that ship around here before. I wonder where it came from. Dreary town. But it carries a delectable scent. Its cuisine may be promising. What's the matter, lass? You look like a fish out of water. Is this a trading ship? Indeed, and I am its captain. Well, Captain, the name's Tressa. I'm a merchant in this town. A pleasure to meet you. I'm sure you have all kinds of neat cargo on board. Say, do you mind if I take a peek? I'd love to see what you've brought from overseas. 
<laughs> you have a true merchant's eye, lass. You gaze at a simple trading ship as if it were made of solid gold. Alas, I only allow passage to those I trust. Check it out. Busy as a bream, that one. That was a random shadow. Oh, I guess it was this tree here. Okay. Never mind. I was like, is there a person off stage that we're not supposed to be able to see? But no, we're fine. Dun dun dun. Don't I beg you! That's all I have left! <laughs> then we will be in the same boat, matey! We got nothing left ourselves, ain't that right, Mac? Like Mick and Mac, huh? <laughs> I'm Mick, and when we be needing something, we be taking it. It's what pirates do, after all. Please, but, but have mercy! Sir. Come, I got the goods from that there shop. It there be only one cabin around here, and it be me. Ha! <laughs> Everyone knows I be the cabin, and you're me first me. We'll see about that, Mac, you scurvy swine. Aye, we will, Mick, you scabby bottom sea bass. Can't you both be the captain? <laughs> Fine, now show us what other treasure you be hiding. Hey! Hey, stop that! <laughs> Says who? I won't Says me! It. The people here are merchants and fishermen doing all they can to put food on the table. Have a heart. Don't steal what little they have from them. How's this for heart? I'll give you one chance to shove off, kid. But I... Best to be on your way, little one. We're doing grown-up business here. I'm not going anywhere. That was the wrong voice. Well, well. What you got there, kid? It's Rainbow One, and it be ours now. Hey! Ah. A brat like ye wouldn't appreciate it none anyways. We're doing ye a favor right by taking it off your hands. Now say thank ye. Give it back. Lass. That's enough, lass. Dun dun dun. Think again. But they don't look like the types who listen to reason, Savvy. <laughs> that lily livered scallywag knows what he's talking about, kid. Best take his advice to heart. In this world, the strong take while the weak quake. Thank you kindly for the loot, you deck when worms. Aye, well. it's a been a bloody pleasure. There's no need to pretend. Your legs are trembling. It's just a cramp, that's all. Lass. Not even the best merchants can buy back his life once it's taken from him. I know, mm -hmm. but... Why wouldn't they just leave us alone? Those pirates should be out at sea. 
Instead, they're holed up in the caves of Maya, west of town. What do I do now? I lost the bottle of wine one. Can I not just say no? Apparently not. Uh, I guess now I need to go west. Sounds about right. But there's something here? Oh no. Just don't go that way, it's all the same. Save space, please. Or not. Who needs it? Hello there. Oops, I spilt more drink. Oh well, it's fine. Going somewhere, lass? Captain! Oh. If I didn't know better, I'd say that you were setting a course straight for the pirate's den. Awfully rash, wouldn't you say? I know, well, but... I... And still, you intend to go, I see. That must mean you have a foolproof plan of attack. And a weapon, of course. You wouldn't dare go empty-handed, would you? Only a fool would think they could haggle their wares back from dastardly pirates. I know, but I can't just sit by and do nothing. Those poor people might starve if they don't get their belongings back. On my honor as a merchant, I can't let them get away with this. A oh. fine choice of words, lass. R really? really? Aye, if you're so determined, I won't stop you. Oh, On the condition that you let me help. How so? Uh. I'm willing to part with some of my wares if you think they'll prove useful on your journey. If there's something that catches your eye, consider it yours. For the right price, of course. Deal! It's a trap! I guess we don't have any, do we? No. I'm imagining I shouldn't have bought anything, and that's the trick. And what oh. would you need sleepweed for? I'm sure those pirates must be exhausted after all that looting. So I thought I'd help them relax by slipping some of this into their wine. <laughs> You're a clever one, aren't you? Off you go then, and be safe out there, lass. I should have got other things. Oh well. Thank you. But can I? Thank you for the one bit. This is my first bit. This is a test to see what they do. Thank you very much. It gets me one cent directly to me. Uh, coming out July 15th. Although, because of conversions, I'll only get a 73rd of a... No, not a 73rd. 0 0.73 pence. Because that's kind of how the conversion is to the UK and US dollars and pounds. But, oh well. You just gave me money and you got a shout out. And you can get them for free using ads. By the way, Captain. Why are you helping me? Because my eye tells me to do so. He's got a third eye underneath that hair, huh? It looks a bit blue to me, but I am colorblind. As a fellow merchant, I'm sure you understand. We appraise with our eyes, and mine tell me there's something special about you. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Thank you, Captain. <laughs> that should do the trick. Now to make a special delivery to the Caves of Maya. And so I'm on my way to the pirate's den. Really? You're gonna help me? Can't thank you enough. You've got a heart of gold. 
Now that I've slipped some of the slippery into their wine. Once they've dozed off, the stolen words will be as good as mine. Ah! So it's back to Ophelia again. Ah, I see. Gotcha. Okay. Sure, I'll fight with Ophelia too. Double down on this. 